you know, we're fixing everything. And because there is always something to fix, let's uh, change the oil cover gasket on this 1.816 valve engine. Now, to remove it, there is a pipe here from the thermostat that needs to be undone. It's holding itself by this bolt and you need to undo all the other bolts which are here, 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 here. I think here, here. And there is three on the back, especially these two. A little bit tricky to catch, so prepare yourself a magnet. Take the cover out. And let's get to the bench. I'll just catch it here so I can um, have it more easy on the back and you can see this one is complete plastic yeah how much more plastic it can be so you can expect plastic to not hold oil you know rubbers hold oil especially around the curves here yeah and it's not that expensive it's only a well, I don't even know I bought them as a book so I don't know Oh, they're flying! <laughs> this is flying, absolutely flying. Oh, I had bad. <laughs> I had bad ones, but this one is the worst. Maybe it's the original one from the 2000, 20, 20, 22, 23 years old. Even this one is from the 1999. 25 years, quarter of a century. <laughs> Insane. And some people don't give up nothing about their cars. They really don't. Well, if it was working and not leaking, but I can tell you it's leaking. The side of the engine is completely toast. So, can you give me I will be catching parts of this one for years. They're absolutely everywhere. Never mind. That's good enough. Good. The nice thing is that now I'll take some brake cleaner and I'll just spray it off here. So take some brake clean and just spray off here. Okay, so that's good. Now, if you don't want to waste that much brake clean or chemicals, you can just take a piece of cotton, take a little screwdriver and chase all the gaps, yeah? That's what you can do. Even I will do it here. So... So 
so I don't have any moisture left. And the ones here as well. Okay. Now, we need a new gasket. Let's get a new gasket. I've never had one arrive like this, but spaghetti style Victorine. That's for 1.8, that was a part number. For 1.8 uh, petrol kick X18 XC1. 16 volt engine. Let's see now. You just change it into place. It's a little bit on the high side, which is not bad. No wonder it had a little wall of foil inside the spark plugs. Now, if you still have a problem with leaking gasket, because it is possible, yeah, it is possible, uh, take some Victor Reigns sealant and just chase it all over the place, you know, all around the gaps. Okay, so now, Let's get back to the engine, prepare your bolts, 8 newton meters is the torque. Now we need to get to the engine and get all this area clean, yeah? And when I say clean, I mean spotless. All this, with a real, little bit of uh, brake clean, all the sides, especially here, yeah? Especially here, that's a very important spot. Now I only have like 5% battery left, clean, clean, the greased, now you can see how much is sticking out, or can you, yeah it's sticking out, there we go, now if my dro battery drops, I hope the video is being helpful there, yeah? How I'm gonna throw them is going to be spiral, yeah. So where you see a bolt, you go in a spiral pattern. Eight newton meters. I'll just put them in quickly. Okay, so I got all of the bolts head tight, hand tight, just to save time. On the video and I think to start from uh, this bolt here with uh, 8 newton meters if you can use a when you got access to a wrench, torque wrench, it's gonna be brilliant. Okay, you can see the pattern. I think you can. Hopefully you can. Okay. I'll oh, actually miss this one. And I think the cross pattern here will work better. There isn't actually a manual 
to say which is the better way and we'll continue all of them from the beginning just because it's a large area and some of them make you know the seal may <coughs> get a bit loose uh, a bit, I don't know, compressed okay, now here there you saw it needs a bit more but that's all done that's everything that it needed that's it, I hope the video is being helpful to you give me a comment I hope it doesn't leak unfortunately as you can see it's not in the car so uh, I'll put it in the comments if there is any problems but I think it will be fine most importantly is here uh, I will see you on the next one bye bye